the Latino Professionals Association presents our third annual Brindis del Éxito celebration. El Brindis del Éxito gathers LPA and community members for the celebration of Latino achievements and public recognitions over the past year. This event offers a significant opportunity for community organizations and businesses to support the growth and accomplishments of our Latino professionals. Here are the awardees. Presented by the Business Forum, the Athena Young Professional Leadership Award honors emerging leaders who strive towards the highest levels of personal and professional accomplishment, who excel in their chosen field, devote time and energy to their community in a meaningful way, and serve as a role model for young women. This year's recipient is Myra Madrano. Myra serves on numerous boards and committees directly involved in regional planning, economic development, and diversity, addressing community concerns and emerging leadership in philanthropy. She is currently board president of the Latino Chamber of Commerce of Dane County. Additionally, in 2016, Myra was named on the list of Wisconsin's 48 most powerful Latinos by Wisconsin State Journal, Madison 365. The Business Forum recognized her as the 2016 Athena Young Professional Award winner. The Hilda Contreras Thomas Leadership Award is given to an individual, group, or organization that has demonstrated outstanding effort in ensuring that Latinos have a strong voice in Dane County through the tireless advocacy and leadership. This year's recipient is Diego Campo Verde Cisneros. Diego Campo Verde Cisneros, a bilingual senior marketing coordinator, has become a fixture of the Latinx and LGBT community. He served for many years as a production manager at La Movida, a Spanish language radio station prior to joining Quartz. He has been active with both Madison's gay and Latinx communities. Having started the AIDS network Hermanos Latinos in 2002, Alanza Latina, and most recently, Orgullo Latinx, which works to support and enhance the lives of the Latinx LGBT community in the Madison area. The Visionary Award is given to an individual, group, or organization that has demonstrated leadership and substantial commitment to the Latino community. This year's recipient is Suhey Baser. Born and raised in Venezuela, Suhey Baser is a branch manager for Park Bank in Sun Prairie, where she leads, supervises, and administers the operation and business development of the branch. Having been a Madison resident since 2001, Suhey serves as a board member of Centro Hispano of Dane County. She is also a volunteer for the Junior Achievement. Suhey is the food blogger behind the Five Senses Palette, where she shares delicious recipes. She is a writer for Capital City Hughes and a contributor of Brava Magazine. She is also a proud member of the LPA. The Robert G. Sanchez Award is given to an individual or organization in the community that has demonstrated outstanding leadership and commitment to promoting educational and career opportunities for Latinos in Dane County. This year's recipient is Dr. Eduardo Mancia. Dr. Eduardo Mancia received his Doctorate of Philosophy in Curriculum and Instruction in 2015 and holds two Master Degrees in Multicultural Education and in Counseling Psychology from the University of Wisconsin, Madison. He has been an education advocate for many years. Dr. Mancia has served the Madison community in many capacities. Dr. Mencia is currently working as the Director of Education Administration and School of Education faculty member at Edgewood College. Dr. Mencia's leadership in advancing educational and career opportunities for Latinos in Dane County is truly remarkable. Presented by In Business Magazine, 40 Under 40 lists outstanding professionals under the age of 40 and celebrates the success of rising young business stars in the greater Madison area. This year's recipient is Christian Alboras. Christian Alboras is a UW Whitewater grad with a master's degree in business administration in management. He provides financial education and empowerment to local employers and their employees through Summit's award-winning financial education program, See You at Work. Civically, he was tabbed by Mayor Paul Soglin to serve on the Madison Police Department Policy and Procedure Review Ad Hovic Committee charged with improving police community relations. Dr. Nestor Rodriguez 
Despite coming from a single-parent Spanish-only home, Dr. Nestor Rodriguez successfully became the first person in his family to obtain a high school degree. From Yale University to the University of Wisconsin-Madison School of Medicine and Public Health, and after a successful academic career, he left to pursue other lifelong aspirations. While still practicing emergency medicine, he opened Carbon World Health, a medical and fitness spa. His work with Carbon World Health takes him back to underprivileged areas as he has established free fitness and weight loss programs for single-parent, low-income homes. The Making a Difference Award honors an individual who are making significant contributions to their community through their time, actions, talents, and dedication. This year's recipient is... Fabiola Hamden. Fabiola Hamden is a bilingual, bicultural, community senior social worker with Dane County Department of Human Services who works with a program called Joining Forces for Families. She has a master's degree in social work from UW-Madison and 17 years of experience as a community social worker. She is a strong advocate for the Hispanic community, having created numerous organizations, programs, and initiatives to support immigrants in the Latino community, such as the Latino Support Group, La Soup, El Dia de los Niños, Latino Children and Families Council, and the Latino Professionals Association. The Hispanic Achievement of the Year honors leaders who are successful, exemplify the highest standards of their profession, promote diversity and inclusion in the workplace, demonstrate leadership, and invest time and resources into their community. This year's recipient is Tanya Ibarra. Tanya Ibarra is a dynamic and agile leader. Tanya advocates to ensure all people have fair opportunities to contribute, succeed, and be gainfully employed. Tanya is an avid problem solver. She is the founder of the Latino Professionals Association, Step Up Equity Matters, and Talent Connections Career Coaching Programs. Tanya believes in creating win-win relationships that maximize resource utilization. Tanya has extensive experience in the finance industry providing assurance, consulting, business process review, and organizational development services. The Community Leader of the Year Award honors an individual who has made a positive difference in the community and demonstrates unwavering support, dedication, and enthusiasm for the betterment and growth of their community. This year's recipient is Gloria Reyes. Gloria Reyes, hailing from the east side of Madison, is Deputy Mayor for Public Safety, Civil Rights, Public Health, and Community Services. She is currently involved in police reform efforts overseeing the Madison Police Department policy review process and committee on body cameras. She is leading the efforts on racial equity and social justice and immigration efforts for the city of Madison. She is a product of Centro Hispano of Dane County, receiving a scholarship and assistance that helped her advance in her educational and career goals. The Volunteer of the Year Award is awarded to a dedicated member, volunteer, and asset to the Latino Chamber of Commerce of Dane County. This year's recipient is Jonathan Gramley. Jonathan Gramley, a publisher and editor of the Capital City Hughes, has been deeply involved in Madison's civil rights movement and other issues for the past 45 years. As a student at the University of Wisconsin-Madison in the early 1970s, Gramling attended Alcorn State University, a historic black college. Jonathan has been an instructor for the UW People Program for the past 13 years. Jonathan has volunteered with many Madison area groups, including Centro Hispano of Dane County, the Urban League of Greater Madison, the African Association of Madison, the Latino Chamber of Commerce, and the NAACP Dane County Branch. Presented by Madison Magazine, the M List is a who's who of organizations and individuals who are having an impact on our local culture and economy. This year's recipient is Oscar Morales. Oscar Morales is a teacher, an author, and Madison's Poet Laureate, a title bestowed upon him by the Madison Arts Commission until 2018. But his greatest honor, he says, has been serving as an executive director at the Omega School for 22 years. He was named Wisconsin Hispanic Man of the Year by UMOS and earned the prestigious City of Madison, Dane County, Martin Luther King Jr. Humanitarian Award in 2009. Oscar was recently named the first Latino poet for the city of Madison. The 
Madison Metropolitan School District recognizes an individual or team who has helped make major strides in our efforts to cultivate a work environment that attracts, develops, and retains top talent. This year's recipient is Jorge Araujo. Jorge Araujo is an employee of the Madison Metropolitan School District as well as Board of Directors for Colombianos in Wisconsin. He has been a disc jockey for the past 29 years as well as a radio station producer. He has shared his passion for music by volunteering at several community events. Jorge was awarded a Madison Metropolitan School District Distinguished Service Award in 2012 and Madison Metropolitan School District Thriving Workforce Award in 2017. Brother of Sigma Lambda Beta Fraternity Incorporated present Light the Way Awards in recognition to those who continuously work for the betterment of their communities and whose efforts create a better tomorrow and inspire others. This year's recipient is Laura Minero. Laura Minero is a Los Angeles Posse mentor and a counseling psychology PhD student at the University of Wisconsin, Madison. Laura is currently working hard to turn UW Madison into a safe haven for undocumented students and co-founded Dreamers of UW Madison. Despite the political climate, Laura is very open about her undocumented status and continues to show endless support for the undocumented families in Madison and around the nation. Sustained Dane celebrates local leaders who further a shared vision of Big S Sustainability, whose champions earn the title Badger Pioneer for their pioneering work that makes the Greater Madison region more sustainable. This year's recipient is Karen Menendez Collar. As the Executive Director of Centro Hispano of Dane County, Gadden's ambitious approach to Centro's fundraising has enabled the agency to expand and develop more programming, service more people, and become a force in the overall Madison community. Gadden is also named in Business Magazine's 40 Under 40 Class of 2015. The Young Professionals Trailblazer Award is presented to young professionals who are growing and excelling in their respective fields and who have shown leadership within their company and industry. This year's recipient is Sandy Morales. Sandy Morales believes all children and youth should have a caring adult mentor. She hopes to increase the number of children served from 600 to 1,000 by 2020. Sandy has served in leadership roles for both the LPA of Greater Madison and the Latino Chamber of Commerce of Dane County. She currently sits on the Sun Prairie Community Schools Executive Team and was recently elected to the Downtown Madison Rotary Board of Directors. The Young Professionals Impact Award is presented to a community leader who has established a record of consistent outreach to young professionals in the Greater Madison area. Such an individual invests time in the professional growth and development of young professionals to help them realize their full potential. This year's recipient is Dr. Nestor Rodriguez. Dr. Nestor Rodriguez immigrated from El Salvador to Los Angeles at the age of seven. Since then, his path has taken him from Yale University to the University of Wisconsin-Madison School of Medicine and Public Health. Throughout his academic career, he has been committed to both graduate medical education and minority advocacy. He currently serves on the executive board of the Latino Professionals Association as VP of Programs. Drawing from all of his experiences, he has been an asset as serving the needs of our Latin American professionals. Women business leaders face unique challenges and as the numbers grow, so do the opportunities. Featured this year are four local successful businesswomen who are leaders in their industries. This year's recipient is Anna Hooker. Anna Hooker is a Senior Vice President for Exact Sciences, one of the top executives in Madison's burgeoning biotech sector. She brought more than 20 years of lab experience when she accepted the position overseeing all laboratory operations. With an undergrad degree from Kansas State and an MBA from Westminster College in Salt Lake City, she spent 15 years in a variety of positions with ARUP Laboratories in Utah. Madison's Brava Magazine presents the Women to Watch Award for women who make great things happen in the greater Madison area and beyond. Leading boldly, unleashing creativity, championing change, advocating for women, children, and families to improve our community and our lives. This year's recipient is 
Eugenia Podesta. Eugenia Podesta channels over 15 years of nonprofit and international development experience into her role as co founder of Synergy Coworking. She is passionate about each professional hat she wears a female entrepreneur, a director of economic empowerment and entrepreneurship at Vital Voices Global Partnership, an international NGO based in Washington, D.C., and a local business mentor. Eugenia holds a BA, MA, and JD from UW Madison. Thank you to our sponsors.